Hello guys, uh, I am Rejwanul Haknabil from Tech Mechanism. Today I have got here a ESP32 circuit. Here you can see I just removed the main ESP32 module from this uh, from here to the another part another part in a ferro board uh, to testing some standalone feature of the ESP32. But the problem is when I running a code a simple Wi-Fi connection code then you can see here brown brown detector was triggered but when I uh, run the same code in this same in this module there is no problem so what is actually the problem what caused cause it to go to brown out detect detection so now I will show what actually the problem so what is actually happening here it is uh, when I connected uh, when I separated the module from this module to here to there I connected some cable so this cable is not so actually good quality so that what happening is it already added some extra resistor to the circuit so here he, where is the 3.3 volt but when it goes the can goes through this uh, cable because of the resistance of the cable and the and this cable is not so good quality that is why voltage has uh, dropping here so for for the result of voltage dropping the esp32 module become brown uh, brown out so that it's keep restarting keep restarting so one of the uh, solution of this problem is make sure the cable is as low as possible as short as possible and add a capacitor in the in the circuit especially as close as possible to the esp32 so when i added a 104 this capacitor in the in here as close as possible to the ESP32 module, the problem has gone and no brownout detec detection. So, if I measure the voltage, now I will show you the vo voltage. If I measure the voltage from ground to, I hope you are seeing. See? The voltage constantly dropping while restarting 3.17 sometimes lower than 3 uh, three volt so that's the problem it should be very stable for stable operation so sometimes it it works sometimes not so this causes the instability so if I measure the voltage in in this part I can see here you can see it's stable sorry uh, sorry for my probing here is a stable 3.33 but for, for actually it's my bad because yes now 3.3 .3. but when i connect the multimeter to here then we can see the voltage is not stable so so wh what we have learned here is for esp32 voltage stable voltage is very important not just for esp32 for any microcontroller or any embedded system so be careful about the voltage instability so i hope you, you learned something and if you face this problem just make a good connection make a capacitor and make the cable as short as possible thank you very much